What's going on guys and welcome back to another episode of Ark Aberration Ascended. Last we left off, we went to the surface entrance. We went to another part of the surface and we managed to get some more loot. So let me show you some of the stuff I ended up getting, like off camera and whatever. So off camera I got like a bunch of saddles. Do I have the rock drake on me? Of course I don't. Which means I'm going to have to use the elevator to get down. Or do I use milk silk? Do I use milk silk to get down? You know what milk silk? That'll make it a lot easier. Climb down, right? You can climb down. Yep. Yeah, this is, this is the way to go. This is the way. Yeah, let's get back down there. So yeah, as we're going down there, let me tell you what we're doing in today's episode. Today's episode, we will be going back into the radiation zone. That's right. We're going back to the radiation zone so we can go into the cave to get the last artifact needed. We'll get our spare armor. We managed to get some better hazmat equipment. Let me see what we got for shotguns. Uh, so we got a blueprint. We got a 296 shotgun with 130 ammo. I'm gonna save that for the Rockwell boss. But for this, what we're doing is uh, we're gonna go in and uh, with the Rock Drake, obviously. I'm gonna put these Megalosaurs away. We're gonna use the Rock Drake to get over there. Once we're in the radiation zone, we'll put on the hazmat suit, of course. And then we'll go from there. So, where is my Rock Drake? Rock Drake, where are you, buddy? Alright, so, we're gonna grab the last artifact today. We're not gonna do the boss just yet. I want to... What I want to do is, I want to do some more stuff beforehand. And we have time before Extinction comes out. So, where is that damn Rock Drake? There's the Rock Drake. He was right here the whole time. So let's go deep down, dive into the abyss. Now with the Rock Drake, it should definitely make traveling the radiation zone a lot easier. Because last time we went down there was to get Rock Drake eggs, and we went in there with a Megalosaurus, I believe. Alright, jump please, thank you. You know, it's very loud. I'm going to turn that down. Give me a second. Much better. That was very loud in my ears. But anyway, we're going to head into the radiation zone. And we're going to see if we can... We're going to see if we can get the last artifact. So, I've pulled the coordinates up. Like, I took a picture of the coordinates. And let me see if I got the photo. There they are. So, we've got... 8147. Once we get down there, we want 8147. So you know what? I'm gonna save up to here just in case the game crashes again. Because I tried to do this before and the game crashed, so... Well, not this particular thing, but like last episode when we went to the surface. Alright, so let's go into the radiation zone. And we want... We want 81.47, that's what we want. Yeah, going with the Rock Drake is going to make it a lot easier. What level is this Megalosaurus? A 135 male with only 15 points into health and 20 points into melee. Eh, not worth it. Still trying to look for a max level. There's a 125 spider in there. And a 55 Junkasaurus. There we go. Alright, let's keep going until we get to the radiation zone. There's a couple of ways to get to the radiation zone. I just want to go wherever it would, like, take me to the radiation zone quicker. Like, the cave quicker. Oh, there's two of them. Alright, there's a 15 and a 10. That should be easy enough. I think I have found the entrance to the cave. I think it's just in here. I think this is it. 
This is the cave we need to be in. Yeah, we just need the rock drake, and then we can get the artifact easy. Hopefully. Yep, this is definitely a cave. A cave within a cave. How lovely. Arno and a Megalosaur down here. Yeah, this is definitely a cave area. I'm just gonna kill everything I see. Oh yeah, we got we got feather lights down here too. There are just so many creatures here. Let's start killing them. What was that red one? That's a 50. There is so much stuff in here. It's not even funny. Alright, where do we find this artifact? I'm guessing we follow down here. It's gotta be down, down here somewhere. Surprise! all the reapers or seekers even the artifact is at 9151 where are we at now we're close oh we got a red drop here let's see if we can grab this drop real quick oh okay we got some really good loot we got a, an Ascendant Shotgun, a 188 Ascendant Spino, 260 Ascendant Faso, and a 187 Ascendant Dire Bear. Okay, alright. That's some good loot. That is some really good loot, actually. It's not in the water, is it? <gasps> That's not water. Get up there. That's Molting Element. That's not water. Alright, I'll let you guys know when I find this artifact. Don't you dare land in the element. Don't you dare. Alright. We managed to find it. The artifact of the stalker. It took a while, but we managed to find it. So, now we just need to get the hell out of here before my hazmat suit breaks. And we are out of here. Which means we can put on our regular armor at this point. Wait. Is that what I think I said? An Ascendant Long Neck Rifle? Yes, please. We'll have to test this bad boy out. Can't believe we got a, an Ascendant Long Neck Rifle. Must have got that from like a drop or something. I'll have to... I'll have to do some editing. When I edit the video, I'll see what happens, so... Alright. And we're finally back at base. Let's just park you here for now. You can drop everything in your inventory. We managed to get an Ascendant Rifle, probably from one of the drops that I picked up while I was down there. So we got a, a much better Ascendant Rifle. So it's got, how much damage does it have? 331% damage. That's pretty good, actually. All right. So I figured let's end the episode off by collecting some eggs and then putting the artifact in the base. We've collected all three artifacts. Don't worry, I'm not going to fight the boss just yet. There's a lot more I want to get done beforehand. Oh, we got a couple basilisk eggs to hatch. Let's hatch some basilisk eggs while we wait. Alright, let's see what we got. Alright, you lost both. Lost both. Lost the melee. Lost both. Oh, we got one that kept the stats. We got one that kept the stats, which is awesome. So we got a female. So this female can go into retirement. So let's go ahead. While we wait for those other eggs to hatch, let's go ahead. Maybe put Rock Drake away. And then... Let's get the last artifact. Put it away. 
And then I'm thinking next episode, we'll see if we could try to tame a Laylapse. I think that's that's our next goal. The Retrosaur thing. I want to see what that thing looks like. It's It looks super amazing. Alright, let's put this stuff away. We'll put the hazmat suit away and the, the other long neck rifle. And some other stuff we can put away, like the advanced bullets. We got so many advanced bullets, it's not even funny. We'll put that away, and boom. There we go. And we'll put the last artifact over here. Boom. Now we have all three aberration artifacts. We've got the artifact of the... Whatever, depths. The artifact of the shadows. And now the artifact of the stalker. So now for the gamma boss, we only need these three artifacts. So if we wanted to, we could try to fight Rockwell. But we're not going to do that just yet. I just figured we'd get that done. And while we wait for those eggs to hatch, let me take out the rock drake. Let's head down and see what our ravagers and dire bears are up to. And then we could test out our new and improved basilisk. You stay there, rock drake, for right now. Let's check on our bears. So for the bears, we need a 224. And for the Ravagers, a 232. So let's check. 232. Nothing on that. 224. We got a bear with a weight mutation. I mean, you do look all white and whatever. Eh, you don't look too different. You know what? We'll, we'll get rid of you. Right, we're going to get the 251 Basilisk Saddle. We, since we got a better saddle and we're going to be good to go. Oh, God. Well, these guys are kind of like the u -Turenis. When you get in trouble, they start roaring. Alright, I am getting a little hungry. So, do we have any meat? No, we don't. Alright. Alright, let's see what we got. Let's start with the basilisks. Alright, you lost both, you lost the health, and you lost both. Alright, no point in keeping any of those basilisks. Let's move on to the Gigantoraptors. I think they do ha already have mutations, so I don't think we're going to get any mutations from these. I don't even know why we're bothering with this. Alright, let's try 163. Nope, okay. Kill those. Moving on to the Megalosaurus. We only have one Megalosaurus. Really? Only one? Uh, what would we get? 36 and 36. Alright, we, we kept both. Or was it... Did one have 37? Alright, we got the 36 melee. Yep, I think, I think we're good. I think we're good. Warrior points into melee. You were 36 and 36. Alright. 34. Okay. So we got the... Perfect stats. Lost the melee, lost the health, lost the health. Yep. No luck with the berries. Alright, moving on to the spinos. We need a 212. 212. Alright, so let's see. 212. We got a 212, and it is a food mutation. Ah, alright, wonderful. I will keep breeding those up. And yeah, we'll keep breeding that up and we only have one more thing to do today. Let's go in, take our imprinted Basilisk out for a spin. Basilisk, you should be fully imprinted and ready to go with your Ascendant Saddle. We start with 16,000 health, which is pretty good. So, Bite does... 778. Really good, if you ask me. What level is this? A uh, game. 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 Thank you. That's a 10. Alright. The spit does 849. And it does damage over time. I forgot about that. That's a 20 dire bear. 1699. That must have been a headshot. 
The only thing I can think of. Let's kill this crab. Oh yeah, we're really good. Our newly imprinted basilisk is really good. We managed to get one with best the best stats possible, and it's honestly really good. Do we do torpor? I don't think we do torpor. Oh, we do a little bit of torpor. Not much. That's a 145. Damn. 95 dire bear? That might be a good test subject. Alright, let's test you out. Okay. That kind of does a lot of damage, if I'm going to be honest. Or a lot of torpor, even. Alright, let's head back home. We've had our fun. Alright, we got 47 levels. Let's go up to 100,000. The weight's good, the stamina's good. Let's put the rest into melee. 7,500. That's way better. Out. Okay. Um, rocks, get out the way. So I can get out of the water. Oh, we just trampled on a moss chops. How nice. All right, so here's our fully imprinted basilisk, ready to go. All bloodied because we did just level them up. Now let's reload our gun because we used it to test it out on a bear. It works really good. But yeah, with that, that's going to have to wrap it up for this episode. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure to leave a like and subscribe for more. It would really help out a ton. But until next time, I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.